Hello everyone and welcome back to Old Guy Firewood. My name is Dick and it is an absolutely beautiful day here in North Carolina. Um, I think I mentioned in one of my previous videos that I get a lot of uh, wood service wood and one of the problems with that is that you pretty much got to take what they bring you and uh, sometimes they bring you some pretty big stuff that's pretty difficult to handle and today uh, we're going to tackle some big oak logs that I've got here and cut them up, buck them up, and uh, put them on the Wolf Ridge splitter and uh, see if we can get them split up and stacked in an IBC tote. So I uh, hope you enjoy the video. Uh, if you've been here before, thanks for coming back. If it's your first time, uh, please enjoy the video, and like, and subscribe. Here we go. Okay, guys, here's what we're working with today. Uh, this is some red oak logs that uh, tree service guy brought in uh, this one right here is about uh, 26 inches at this end about 32 at the other end and um, here's another one came out of that, that same tree trunk but uh, what we're going to be working with today is the Husqvarna 372 XP and the Wolf Ridge Pro 28 compact and we're going to see if we can't uh, get these split up uh, get them on the log lift and see if we can't get them uh, split and put in a, an IBC tote. So uh, let me get the saw going and uh, we'll see what we can do. is not good sparks came flying out the back and uh, no doubt I hit a nail or some piece of metal in there oh yeah not good I'm gonna try to take one more cut see if it'll cut at all the teeth are pretty banged up if it doesn't uh, I'm just gonna have to Take a break, get the saw sharpened back up, and go from there. <laughs> now, it's toast. All right, take a little break, get it sharpened up, or get a new chain on there, and we'll start again. Look at what that, whatever it is in that log, piece of metal did to these teeth chain is totally wrecked. I'm going to have to take it back about a, an eighth of an inch on each tooth to get to some good, good chrome. Well, everyone's getting a little bit late in the day and I figured instead of uh, putting a new chain on that saw or sharpening it up and trying to cut the rest of this log up, 
Now, the whole purpose of this video is really to show you how we deal with some of this big wood. And uh, so I've just grabbed another saw. I'm going to go ahead and cut this round off the end and uh, we'll put it on the splitter. And I think that'll be a pretty good uh, illustration of how we cut them and how we split them. So uh, let me get this saw going and uh, we'll get this round cut off and we'll go from there. Okay, let me pull this IBC toad over here and we'll get to splitting. Well, there you have it. One round. Um, that thing probably weighed 
uh, every bit of 300 pounds and uh, handle it okay by myself, just rolling it over, getting it on the log lift. That log lift will pick, I haven't put anything on there it can't pick up. I, I think the capacity is listed at around 400 pounds, but uh, I'm sure it would lift more than that. Um, let me show you what we got on one person, one round, I'd say uh, very close to a, to right about a quarter of a tote full. So uh, if I can ever figure out what's in that log and <laughs> get the rest of it cut up, I would say that, that that one log will probably fill this tote with split wood. Well, I think that'll about do it for today, guys. Tree service wood is, uh, is a problem at times. Uh, sometimes it's, it's too big to handle or it's difficult to handle because it's so big. And the, the other obvious problem which we ran into today, to today is uh, you're liable to find some metal in it too. And I hate that. I just touched that chain up before I started cutting. And uh, second cut, second round, I, I caught something in there. I guess we'll find out what it is. But uh, at any rate, I wanted to show you that it could handle that wood. The saw certainly can handle the wood. Um, the log lift can lift it up. And one person can split it and stack it. Now, if I have somebody working with me, it goes a whole lot quicker. Uh, if you have somebody feeding the, the log lift and one person operating the uh, splitter and that second person again taking the split pieces off of the table and putting them in the tote. But I hope you enjoyed today's video and uh, if you did please uh, please hit the like button, please subscribe, uh, share it with your friends and I um, hope you come back and, and see us on the next one. Um, as I always say, uh, as an old guy, uh, the most important thing I can tell you is to keep moving.